Hello student friends today we are going to understand about welding process which is used as a major process in manufacturing processes as far as manufacturing process framework is concerned there are many manufacturing processes available it is the judicious choice of production engineer to select a particular process for his application there are processes available which are called as a metal cutting processes or also called as a machining processes in which different machine tools are used there are processes which are available under category called as plastic deformation processes or metal forming processes those are used in case of a forming requirement there are processes which are used as a fabrication processes and in which welding is a major process which is used as a fabrication process so our requirement is fulfilled by the availability of different types of the manufacturing processes today under this manufacturing processes we are going to cover one unit that is unit number 4 welding processes the lesson one the first one is welding as a fabrication process its basic aspects we are going to understand in this session let us understand the importance of welding how the welding process is defined classification of welding processes and then its process advantage its disadvantages if any and the capability of a process or applications of welding also welding positions and welding joints the lesson objectives are we have to understand the definition of welding the weld, how the welding processes are classed and the welding applications if pro, if any process limitations are there and also we are going to understand the welding positions and welding joints welding is a process which is used for joining different materials it is used for making permanent joint in order to use two or more pieces of metals together the welding is used where the heat essential requirement is heat and you can use pressure in some cases and if pressure is not used then filler material is used to complete that welding so application is concerned it is used everywhere now even in repair and maintenance work regularly as a fabrication process welding process is used but in very in very precision applications also or for joining different types of metals alloys welding process is used in almost all types of you know sectors and that's why welding process is very important the use of today welding as a technology is very extensive the process is very economic and as well as after 1930 we saw a tremendous growth in the welding technology the rate of growth of a welding is more than the <coughs> general industrial applications the uh, rate of growth of industry so that's why welding is a very popular process let us understand the definition of a welding as given by american welding society um, it's a material joining process used in making welds but that material joining process is where the heat is deployed and that is nothing but a process where heat is applied is a localized coalescence that is nothing but growing of the grain structure of the materials being welded and there it is heat is the common source the common parameter that is used but at the same time here you can use complete the weld process with application of pressure or even without application of a pressure by using the filler material so joining of material with application of pressure application of heat and joining of material similar or dissimilar material with the application of heat without pressure and using filler material 
this covers the standard definition of welding based on this there are two types of broad broad classification is there are two types of the welding uh, types of the welding one is plastic welding or a pressure welding in which the piece of metal to be joined are heated to a plastic state and they are forced together with the application of a pressure example is resistance welding the second one is where the material is heated and then they are allowed to solidify and some filler material is added that is it is called as a fusion welding and this fusion welding example is gas welding or arc welding there are more than 35 welding processes are there and the classification of welding first base is the source of heat whether we are using flame arc etc to generate that heat the second one is type of interaction whether the base metal is at a liquid state liquid liquid state it is called as a fusion welding or the base metals are at the solid solid state it is called as a solid state welding so depending upon the type of a heat source that we are using there are varieties of uh, welding processes are available electric welding processes you can classify under electric resistance welding spot welding seam welding projection welding butt welding induction welding and in some cases electric arc is used to get that uh, melting and in this the metallic arc welding carbon arc welding shielded metal arc welding submerged arc welding metal inert gas welding or mig welding tungsten inert gas welding electro slag welding so lot of options are available right from a simple carbon arc welding or regular arc welding uh, to a tungsten inert gas welding or metal inert gas welding regular the application of welding for a regular fabrication work or for precision work all options are available in the arc welding process then another one is popular welding process is gas welding process so heat source is with the help of the combustion of oxy plus acetylene combination that is ignited flame is flame gives me a required temperature which melts the edges and gives me the joining so oxy acetylene is commonly called as a gas welding but there are oxy plus other combination oxy hydrogen oxy methane air plus acetylene all these options are used for different types of the joining and in case of a solid state welding which is used for a very specialized application because interaction of the metal is at a solid state and this solid state welding is called as a there are also varieties of processes are there in that one is friction welding forge welding and thermit welding explosive welding these are the varieties of options available under this solid state welding coming to the uh, advantages of welding and then if any disadvantages we must also look into that and then the application framework advantages are many because this as i mentioned in the beginning after 1930 the growth is exponential one the use is very extensive the welding is there in all the sector and a good weld is as strong as the base metal general welding equipments are not very costly portable equipment serves my purpose you can take those welding equipments to the site welding permits a considerable freedom in design that you can carry out welding as per your requirement and that serves the purpose of designer and you can mechanize the welding also so regular manual welding is also equipments are available semi automatic welding equipments are available and fully automatic welding equipments are also available now coming to the disadvantages of welding as heat high temperature is involved heat is involved in case of arc welding in case of a gas welding you know it gives the harmful radiation fumes spatter and this is from a safety point of view it's a concern welding results in residual stresses and distortion of the workpiece this is a quality aspect 
we need to look into it by providing some allowances welding heat also produces metallurgical uh, changes depending upon the type of material we are processing the type of rod welding rod we are using the welding parameters are to be at the optimum stage in order to avoid the metallurgical changes and even the welding joint welding joint if you prepare it correctly precisely that serves the purpose because weld joint should be as strong as the base metal otherwise if there is any defect in the processing if process parameters are not met fully then the weld joint requires a stress relief heat treatment which is an additional process in order to make that weld joint fit for use and this costs a lot this is another disadvantage but if you uh, control the process parameter it is possible to get the weld joint a quality weld joint as far as application of welding is concerned see a list of areas sectors just a representative list is given here uh, very common is repair and for maintenance work welding is very popularly deployed but in case of even in aviation sector even in automobile uh, construction bridge construction buildings uh, construction pressure vessels tanks storage tanks machine tool frames cutting tools dies pipelines ship building etc household and other furniture so this covers you know if you see wide range of application sectoral scope is there and that's why welding is very popular so far we covered the significance of welding how the welding process is classed its advantages its disadvantages its application so now let us take a small quiz in order to clear our fundamental here what is welding so this is the basic we have to understand the process itself four options are given there one is cutting metal using a torch joining two or more materials by melting and fusing them third option is bending metals into different shapes and fourth option is forming metal with a obviously the answer is b joining two or more material by melting and fusing them the second quiz question is which of the following is a common heat source used in the welding there are four options given first one is water second one is electricity third one is wind source fourth one is sand obviously electricity is the source that is used in the welding processes the third quiz question is in welding what is the term for the materials being joined together one is filler material second one is heat source third one is shielding gas and fourth one is base material obviously it's a base material answer is d fourth question is what is the purpose of filler material in welding that as in the definition itself one is by melting the metal and fusing it and uh, you know applying a pressure is one area in which varieties of processes are there the second one is melting the material and then using a filler material here what is the purpose of filler material in welding there are four options given to provide heat for welding processes to protect the weld from atmospheric contamination third option is to join the base material together and the fourth option is to remove impurities from the welding equipment obviously the answer is to join the base materials together coming to the last part of this introductory uh, session on welding of application process welding positions plays a very important role in giving a quality weld there are four position one is flat position welding in this position the filler material is deposited from the upper side of the joint and the face of the weld is horizontal the second position is horizontal position in this position the filler metal is deposited upon a horizontal surface and the axis of the weld is horizontal third position is vertical position welding in this position the filler metal is deposited upon a vertical surface and axis of the weld is vertical and the fourth position is overhead position in this position the filler metal is deposited from the underside of the joint and the face of the weld is horizontal so a considerable freedom in the weld design is very much essential that's why this purpose is served by 
फ्लैट पोजिशन वेल्डिंग ऑरिजोटल पोजिशन वेल्डिंग वर्टिकल पोजिशन वेल्डिंग एंड ओवर हेड पोजिशन वेल्डिंग वेल्डिंग ज्वाइंट्स ज्वाइनिंग वेल्डिंग इज अ ज्वाइनिंग ऑफ सिमिलर एंड डिसिमिलर मेटल वेल्डिंग ज्वाइंट्स शुड बी एज स्ट्रॉन्ग एज अ बेस मेटल देर आर बेसिक ज्वाइंट्स आर बर्ड ज्वाइंट्स वेर द पार्ट्स लाइंग इन द सेम प्लेन आर ज्वाइंट एट द रेजिस सेकेंड वन इज अ लैब ज्वाइंट टू पार्ट्स आर ओवरलैपिंग ईच ओदर third one is a t joint one part is perpendicular to other to resemble letter t and corner joint parts are joined at the corner so here the bud joint first one where the parts are lying in the same plane are joined at the edges second figure is shown there two parts are overlapping each other third is shown t joint uh, where the one part is perpendicular to the other to resemble the letter t and fourth one is corner joint parts are joined at the corner so this is all about welding a fabrication process the introductory aspect we covered our lesson objective to understand the importance of the welding then we covered welding classification then we understood the advantages of process disadvantages or limitations of process and the application framework and also we understood the welding positions and the weld joints in order to get the perfect quality weld and in that we took a quiz four questions to understand precisely what is welding and its application thank you